Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Rumbi. I am an international student in Lublin, Poland. And I make videos about my life here. So if you are interested in that, then please hit the like button. Please subscribe. Please comment down below. Just do the whole shebang, okay? <laughs> so uh, today I will be eating Polish food only for the whole day. So if it's not Polish, then get it away from me. Today I am going to be eating traditional Polish food only for 24 hours and uh oh my god it's so windy here i hope you guys can hear me so i am at platz litevsky i'm about to go and get my breakfast so i'm going to try and have four meals that is breakfast schnedanie and lunch snacks later on in the day and then obiad which is dinner so uh for breakfast I want to have donuts. So, hello. Hello. <laughs> hello. Okay. Poland. Okay. Africa. Africa. Tak. Czy tu Polsce się podoba? O, nie rozumiem po polsku. Nie, ja, ja, bo mam taki. A tu się, a tu jest. Tak, tak, tak. Dziękuję bardzo. Yo. Dziękuję. Wow. Oh my god. Yeah, so I am at Plus Litewski. I'm about to get my breakfast. Uh, it's donuts and coffee. Oh yeah. Oh my god, this guy just made me forget what I was about to say. So I want to have coffee and uh, donuts. So I am just going to go to McDonald's and grab a cup of coffee and then go to get my donuts. So for those of you who don't know, on the Polish calendar, they actually have a day dedicated to eating donuts. I'll have to do a video about it uh, when the day comes, but yeah, I just thought you guys should know. So that's what I'm going to be having today. It's a, it's a typical breakfast for Polish people. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing. Right now I'm going to McDonald's. There is a queue on the door because they are not allowing many people inside. So I'll have to wait for a bit until I go to get my coffee. Or maybe I should have just gone and get my donuts first. they'll tell you this place is always packed I don't know why today they are just two people I don't know maybe it's because it's too early but yeah this place is always packed like every day so I've got my coffee now let's go get my donuts oh there's this one with vanilla I love vanilla I think I'll have that one there is another one with blueberries with caramel with cream cheese orange and chili oh orange and chili okay 
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, I wasn't expecting that. Oh. <laughs> oh. You know, sometimes um, shop attendants, they do not like being shown in the videos. So I'm actually happy that this man <laughs> is... <laughs> He's happy to show himself. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I would like um vanilla. Yes, one, please. So I just had my donut and my coffee with me so now i'm just going to look for a nice place to go and sit and enjoy my breakfast oh it's windy oh my god Hello. Hello. Uh, is it open? Uh, what do you want? Do you want to order something? I I'm looking for jour. Yes. Uh, sausage, yes. Egg sausage egg soup. Yeah. Of course. Okay. Uh, oh. oh. Wow. Oh. Oh, this is beautiful. <laughs> oh, this is nice. Okay, okay. Wow. Guys. So, I am in one of the restaurants here in Old Town. I found it on Google Maps. I was just looking for Jure and I ended up here. So, I asked the beautiful lady if I could take pictures in, a, in their restaurant and she said yes and then she showed me the way to their sitting place um, upstairs. It's just spectacular, it's beautiful. I'm just shocked. I'm <laughs> so beautiful here and I wish I had somebody to take me pictures of course but yeah. So I don't know, this is just beautiful. I hope that the government will open um, the restaurant soon so that we can actually come and eat and sit down here because it's beautiful it's beautiful i'm just going to take their instagram or facebook i don't know what they have uh, so that you guys can come and check it out oh this are handmade oh it's a ship <laughs> wow this is very authentic this is very authentic, genuine <laughs> Polish culture. This has been the most amazing experience ever. Uh, the restaurant is beautiful. It's really nice. It's, on, it's authentic. Yeah, real authentic Polish culture. Like the way that they decorated the restaurant is just beautiful. And um, the food smells nice. So at the moment, um, the government is not allowing people to come in and sit and eat inside the restaurant so they are actually uh, in the middle of renovating their outside space so that you know once the restrictions are lifted people can actually come and eat outside the restaurant it's actually nice and they are painting real cool pastel colors i hope you guys can see the pinks and the greens and the yellow it's really nice it's coming out really really nice so the restaurant is called I hope I'm pronouncing it right. <laughs> oh my god, and the girl that was showing me around, she's so nice. Oh my god, I can't wait to come back here and experience the whole Polish culture. <laughs> so right now I'm just waiting for my food and yeah, it's very sunny today. I'm sure you guys can see that my face is 
oh my god it's shiny i am just enjoying the weather tomorrow is going to be raining so today i just thought ah let me go out and enjoy the sun whilst it's still there but yeah i'm enjoying it hey 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 my jour is ready let's go eat Ooh. so i'm just going to sit here on these benches right here and enjoy my soup so i've never had soup before like soup isn't something that we eat in my country it's it's soup is just something that you eat with um your pasta or your sadza or your rice so i'm actually you know excited to taste this french soup i hope it's not spicy i hope it's not salty but yeah so it's called shur it's egg and sausage in a soup i told them not to put potatoes because later on during the day i'm going to have uh potato pancakes so yeah So this is what it looks like there to put foil so that it keeps warm I think. Gender So I am uh, in the old town and I can see there is a group with a tour guide that is going around and it's just funny you know people touring your city and oh my god guys can you see that wow oh my god <laughs> and it's so cool <laughs> am i even going to finish this <laughs> oh my god what did i do <laughs> okay so i'm going to use my my folk Oh my god it's hot oh i can see the egg yolk okay mm. it actually tastes nice it tastes really nice and it's not spicy it's not salty it's good i like it It's very hot. <laughs> this will be good in a cold winter evening. Yeah. I feel like if I had grown up in Poland eating this at home i'll be one of those kids who just take the spoon and just uh you know take out all the egg and the sausage and eat all of that and then leave the soup yeah i feel like that i'll be one of those kids because oh well <laughs> I love this I love it hey guys so today has turned out to be the hottest day ever I'm so tired I'm so hot I just I just want to go back home <laughs> but I need to finish this video so I need to keep going right now I am at Oshon I just want to get some potato pancakes and then I'll head home and then later on, I will go 
to find my dinner i don't know where exactly i am going to find it but i have a feeling that one of the traditional restaurants near my previous dormitory has uh, what i'm looking for so when i get home i'll just search on google maps hoping that i will find it so yeah i am at ocean and um as you get in um right at the entrance you will see uh i don't know if it's a restaurant or what i don't know but here it is it has uh traditional polish food i always get potato pancakes here i like them they are so tasty uh i don't know how they make it but it's just different you know from what i had had all this time before so almost every time when i am going home from school i always come to this place and get my potato pancakes so yeah that's why i'm here today and then afterwards i don't know i want to have bigos for dinner so i don't know where i'm going to get it but i don't know i'll, I'll ask them maybe they have it i don't know so i'll ask them and see if they have it then good for me i'm saved uh, from making another trip just too hot out there can dobre tak uh um what ki the um dva zi tsukini dva azi zemnya chane tak ah dva dva tak um e bigos bigos tak um oh <laughs> oh my god i just uh i don't know i don't know if it will taste nice i don't know if it oh my god and i chose the medium uh container oh my god the it is wow i think it's too much wow what am i going to eat it with <laughs> oh my god oh. tak ah uh, shaprasham shaprasham sorry <laughs> okay so i've seen this um yeah then paprik tak okay so i just saw that and i've never nya 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 ah mawe mawe um mawe nya duje mawe ah tak ha <laughs> oh my god my face is shiny so um at least i got everything that i need so now i just have to go home and rest the way the art case is killing me coming from a harsh winter going into this kind of hot weather like back home in africa is just too much the transition was just the just too much and my face was not ready for this guys i look like i just took a bottle of cooking oil or olive oil and just smeared it on my face doesn't even look like i tried anything in the morning hey guys i am now back home it's sometime after 5 oh i'm so tired i've just been walking around looking for food so i had my breakfast i had my lunch i actually brought some back home because i couldn't finish it you guys just saw how 
what the sun was i couldn't stand sitting on that bench for any time longer it was just too much today's weather uh, no if 2021 summer is going to be like that then ooh. it was just bad so today has been tiring i i'm not even energetic anymore yeah so yeah i had my breakfast i had my lunch i left some of the lunch um i still have it i haven't had my snack that's my potato pancakes and i got my dinner as well so whilst i was in the bus coming back home from um ocean where i bought uh, my dinner because i was searching on the internet what people have with figures because i'm pretty sure they just don't eat it like that this is true so i'm pretty sure they have maybe pasta or pierogi or rice i don't know so i was searching and then i found this um i found something about pierogi and um what else did i find bread yeah so i ended up going to leg leg and I bought this bun right here. I don't know what it's called, but this is the bread that I bought. I was just like, oh, this looks like it's polished enough. So I got this to eat with my biggest. And um, I got this. Oh, it's not zooming. Ah, oh, well. Yeah, I got this for my potato pancake. So I didn't want to get sour cream and onions and then have to cut it, cut the onions and then yeah, yeah. So I just got this one because it has the onions inside already. So it will be easy for me. But yeah, this is not uh, sour cream. I think this is cheese. So now I was confused whilst I was in the click because I searched on google translate what um is sour cream and then it, it was like fashne smetanka something like that and then i only could find 18 percent 30 percent 10 percent 20 percent smetanka uh smetanya <laughs> the cream there was it, it wasn't written sour cream so i didn't know and then as i was walking um i found this and i was like but isn't this the the cream and the onions that I saw earlier on Google on Google so I was like ah okay let me just buy this if there are any Polish people watching this video please don't come for me if if this is wrong just you know teach me let me know what I'm supposed to have it with I just saw this with onions green onions and then I was like ah okay this is close to what I saw on Google so yeah I'm going to have this with my pancakes i also got um this juice right here it's hotex um nectar banana so it's banana juice i just searched on google also um polish uh, juice companies and this was the one that i saw first hotex so at least i'm going to be having polish traditional polish food or genuine authentic polish food including the drink yeah oh where do i even start So this is what it looks like. I've got my pancake, potato pancake with zucchini and carrots and yep, onions. Um, potato pancake with potatoes, pepper, red pepper. I think this is cheese, I'm not sure. And I'm seeing some rice and the cream cheese. So yeah. 
let's eat oh you guys can't see <laughs> Funny how I didn't start with the pepper, like, <laughs> oh my god. So this is the potato pancake with zucchini. I've had this before, so I already know that it tastes nice. So yeah, it tastes nice, guys. <laughs> Now with the cream cheese. It smells like um you know those potato crisps uh that are flavored onion, cheese and onion. Yeah, like I, I think Zimbabweans would know from back home these this. I think they were chumpkins, yeah, chumpkins, flavored uh, cheese and onion. It smells like that. Oh my god, guys, this no. <laughs> This is good. Oh my god. Wow. Okay, so now I'm gonna be buying this every day. This is really nice. I can even put this on my bread. So I don't eat um, butter on bread. I don't eat margarine. So this would be really good for my bread. Ah, I like it. Oh my god, it tastes really nice. Ooh. Wow. So when you guys uh, try these potato pancakes, make sure that you get this on the side because this is really nice. The potato pancakes without this, they are okay. But with this, hmm, just try it for yourself. <laughs> okay, so now let's try the <laughs> paprika. Or the red pepper so I've never had this before I don't know what it's called I don't know what it has inside I don't know I just saw it and I was like okay I'll taste it today so um, I hope that it's going to taste nice Okay, so this is a bit hard, so I guess this is cheese. Mm. Okay. Um, yeah, it is rice, but I don't know what the rice... Um, Oh, I don't know what the rice uh, is is mixed with. Oh my god! Okay, let me taste the rice itself first. like a meat paste I don't know what kind of meat it is but it's, it's a paste of some sort of meat so yeah it's, it tastes okay it's not bad it's not bad at all
I hate things that take long to chew. Like, oh my god, I was chewing like I don't have the time. So the rice is falling apart, it can't stay under the cheese or inside the pepper. I don't know what to do with it. Uh, I should just eat this with a spoon. Mm. Mm. What kind of food frustrates like this? And then it was time for me to have my bigos, of which I didn't have. <laughs> I don't like cabbage. And there was a lot of it in this container and a few pieces of meat. So I just ate a bit to taste it and it was okay. It wasn't bad. I kind of felt like it looks and tastes like the one that we have in my country. Those from Zimbabwe know. So yeah, 